Tell me about my commute to work. On your way to work, traffic is light, as usual. It is 17 minutes by car. You can see the full directions on your phone. Turn on the table lamps in my room. What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back for another video. I've got to fix up my hair, I've got to change real quick, and then I promise we're going to be talking about the Google Nest Mini. Hold it right there and I'll be right back. Alright guys, we are all set and ready to roll, so let's get into the office and get this video started. You guys are going to love this one. I, I love automating my home with the Nest Mini. It's so awesome, so convenient. Look, we've got a little scene set here. All the Philips Hue lights are set to different colors. Turn on office. Sure, turn the three lights on. All right, so this is where everything happens. I record and do everything at this desk. So what do we have here? Let's check it out. Let me see if I can get this thing out. This is a Google Nest Mini that I have for you guys. So if you want to grab one for free, I will give you more details a little bit later. But for now, I'm just going to set up everything and let's get this thing started. Alrighty guys, we are all set up and ready to roll. If you're new here, my name is Kasim. I talk about tech and smart home tech. And if that's something that you're interested in, consider subscribing because it does help my channel grow. But for now, Let's start and talk about the Google Nest Mini. All right guys, let's take a quick tour of the design. So right now you've got these four lights. These actually normally indicate your volume. So when you change it like that down here, these are like touch sensitive. So, but it's orange right now because we actually have the mic muted. So it wouldn't react to it. So that's your mic mute switch. Your adapter goes in here. And then this is actually to hang it up on the wall. So very cool, very small, very simple design. All right guys, so up until the point that I actually bought this, I had only used Siri to automate my home and that wasn't fun for me. Even though I love Apple products, I really didn't like Siri. It just doesn't sound natural to me. And so I would just open up whatever app it is required for my smart home device and I just toggle on and off, turn up the brightness, whatever I wanted to do, I was using apps for. When I got this, all I wanted was a small speaker to put in my room that I could just enjoy some music while I'm chilling now, while I'm just relaxing. I've already got a Sonos out in the living room, so I didn't really need anything heavy duty. So I'm gonna actually play a small clip for you guys from my iPod Touch. I'm gonna put this screen either on the left side or right side, you guys will be able to see it. So if you have the YouTube Music app, this is going to be awesome because you can actually broadcast the music from the YouTube Music app straight to your Google Nest Mini. Now you can't do that with the YouTube app, so this is something to remember. All right, so let's take a listen, okay? I'm going to turn it up. Now it's at max volume. All right, so that's just a small sample clip. This thing doesn't sound that bad at all. I think it's perfect. Like this room is actually more open, so the sound is probably going everywhere in this room, but for my room that I showed you guys earlier, it is a perfect fit. All right, guys, let's talk about the giveaway details. All you have to do is like this video, comment down below as to why you want a Google Nest Mini and be subscribed to the channel. I want to reach 500 subscribers and that isn't possible without you guys. See, when you like a video, when you comment and when you subscribe to me or any other content creator's channel here on YouTube, you are telling YouTube that we are doing a good job. And I know it takes a lot of time and effort and guys, honestly, on our end, it also takes a lot of time and effort to create these videos for you. 
So I thought this would be the perfect giveaway since I'm already talking about this product. As soon as I reach 500 subscribers, I will pick a random person to win this and I know you guys are gonna enjoy it as much as I do. All right, apart from being a great speaker, what I really, really love about this is that you can literally search anything. Google, as we all know, is the largest and most powerful search engine in the whole wide world. So for example, let me tell you what I'm talking about. How's the weather in Hollywood, California? Currently in Hollywood, it's 76 degrees and sunny. Today, it'll be clear with a forecasted high of 82 and a low of 61. What is 28 multiplied by 2 divided by 3? The answer is approximately 18.666667. Find me a flight from IAD to LAX on October 2nd. Flights from Washington to Los Angeles leaving the 2nd of October and coming back the 8th of October start at $247. You're awesome. Thanks. So you guys get the idea, like you can literally search whatever you want. If you can search it on Google, then you can definitely search it here with just your voice. So now onto the fun part, which is integrating Google Assistant with your smart home devices. So over the course of time, I had accumulated a bunch of them. I've got the Nest thermostat, the Nest door lock. I've got Philips Hue bulbs. I've got smart plugs for devices that weren't even smart, like my room fan. And I just started setting up all of these devices inside the Google Home app. And this is where everything got fun. I was able to create routines. I was able to just say, turn off the office desk strip. All right, turning off his desk strip off. And there we go. And turn on the office desk strip. Sure, turning off his desk strip on. So what's cool is that you can either just specify the room, like if you wanted to turn off a whole room, you could be like, turn off the lights in my room. And there you go. The lights are all off or you can specify individual devices. So when you actually set up new devices, you choose what the device's name is and which room you want it to be in. So like, let's say I'm in my room and I'm just reading a book and I just wanna change the color of my lamps. I would just say, change the table lamps in my room to purple. And there you go. They're now changed to purple. Now, another thing I love is using this with my Sonos system. So up until this time, I had not been able to use my Sonos with voice. I have the first generation Sonos sound system and with Google Assistant, I'm now able to just tell it, like I showed you guys earlier, I can play any of these songs that I wanna listen to on my Sonos system or in my room. So there's a lot that you can do here with integrating the assistant with your smart home. Now you're probably thinking that, dude, I don't have hundreds and hundreds of dollars to spend on all this smart home tech. Guys, it's really not that expensive. One very simple, cheap way to integrate appliances inside and around your home with Google Home is to get smart plugs. There's a bunch on Amazon. They range from like 20 to $25. I use the Tekken ones, they're just like this one here. They are, I think, $22. They have over 7,400 reviews. And this is just such a great way to take any standard lamp. Like for example, I use this for my room fan. I have it plugged into this smart plug and this is actually the device that's connected inside of Google Home. So I can just say, turn on my room fan. Got it, turning the room fan on. And there you go. That will trigger Google to turn on that smart plug and now it's it's on. So you can take any standard lamp, any standard appliance and just use one of these to get it automated. All right, next let's talk about routines. So routines are a way to automate certain tasks at either a specific time of day or by just a command. For example, I have one set up for morning time and for night time. So when I wake up in the morning and I say good morning, then that triggers my table lamps in my room to be turned on. 
the room fan to be turned off, and it also turns on the living room lights outside. So with just one word, with just one command or one press of the button from the home app, I can have Google automate a bunch of tasks at one time. Same thing for nighttime, I have the lamps turn off in my room and go into a nightlight mode. The fan gets turned on, the AC gets set to 68 degrees, Google checks to make sure that the door is locked, and all of this is happening with just one command. All right guys, that does it for me in this one. From asking Google Nest Mini the most random questions, playing my music through YouTube Music, and integrating it with all my smart devices around my home, this little device has been such an awesome addition to my home. For $49, I don't think there's really anything else that you could ask for. If you wanna pick up one yourself, I will leave links down below. I will also leave links in the description for the smart plugs. And guys, don't forget to enter the giveaway. Also, please, please, please give this video a thumbs up, comment down below with any questions, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I hope you have an awesome day, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you in the next one. Let's sign off. Goodbye YouTube, see you in the next one.